Elohim, ah, so you are glorious, so glorious in your ways, Makado Sibadina Kaza, so you are mighty, so mighty in your ways, ah, Jesus, so you are wonderful. So wonderful in your way, your way, your way. You are awesome. God bless you, David. So awesome in your way. Ah, so you are faithful. So faithful in your ways. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Hello, Imadonai. Ha, ha, hello, Im. Hello, Imadonai. Ha, ha, hello, Im. Hello, Imadonai. Ha, God bless each and everyone joining in the name of Jesus. David, God bless you. David was the first person to join today. Susie, God bless you. Nana Frank, God bless you. Each and everyone joining. Can we do well to like and share? Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. God bless those that are power tapping, liking and sharing in the name of Jesus. Well, tonight is a prophetic and powerful night. It's a powerful and prophetic night, child of God, wherever you are watching and connecting. Tonight is a night of warfare. Tonight is a night with a different for as many that are joining and connecting. God bless you. Stay with me from the beginning to the end of this live stream. Believe me, you cannot come before the presence of the Lord and go back the same. There is always a word of the Lord that is sharper than two double edged sword that does not only pierce the hearer, it pierce both the hearer and the preacher. That is the reason why the Bible says my word is sharper than two double-edged sword. The Bible says the word of God is a more sure word of prophecy. We have come to receive the more short word of prophecy. The Bible says oh my God, that the word of God is a, is a strong tower that when the righteous run through, they are saved. Today the word of God is about to visit somebody. When the word of God visits you, your story can never remain the same. When the word of God touches you, that sickness leaves you. When the word of God make a move into your family, calamity, limitation and attacks begin to move, begin to leave. The Lord said you need to make a decision if not somebody will go down in your family. I don't know who God is talking to, but there is somebody tonight that this particular prayer is for. The Lord is saying, if you do not make a decision, somebody will go down in your family. But believe me, you coming across this live stream is not by accident. God made it possible for you to come across this, this, this live stream because there is an answer to your prayer. Because there is a solution to what you have been asking God. Believe me, if you're seeing me for your very first time, God bless you. Believe me, child of God. Praise Master Jesus. You can never come before the presence of the Lord and go back the same. God bless each and everyone joining and, and um, joining. Please, can we do it to like and share? Without no waste of time, we are going to be receiving the word of God. It's a powerful and prophetic night session. Yes, Ibaruna Kaza. This is your solution center. You cannot come before the presence of the Lord. You cannot be before the Lord and your story remain the same. You cannot be here and your story remain the same. I have come to speak to somebody. I have come to speak to somebody watching and connecting under the sound of my voice. Mari Kabado Shikadina Kazua. Mefina Kado Nabadia. Something is about to happen. The Bible said there is a time for everything. I have come to speak to somebody that you must make a decision. You must stop now. You must stop him now. If not, somebody will go down. But God forbid we are not going to lose anybody in the name of Jesus. God forbid nobody will go down in our family in the name of Jesus. 
Come on, Naku Sibadi Nakaza. Everybody, can we do it to like and share? I'm seeing 16 people, only five people have like and share. Hallelujah. We are going to take just a few minutes to worship God. As we worship God straight, we are going directly to the point. We are going to receive the fresh word of the Lord, the word of transformation today. Somebody, you might be watching me, just get a pen and a paper. Just get a pen and a paper because you, they, oh my God, Mali Kabadosi Kata. The word of God is a strong tower, and the word of God is the most sure word of prophecy. God bless everyone joining in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Everybody, can we do it to like and share? Wheresoever you are joining, click, click the three dot button at the top right as you're liking and you're sharing in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. Hello, Madonai. Ah, ah, Elohim. The presence of God is here. Everybody make sure you're liking and you're sharing. Elohim, Madonai. Ah, Elohim. Ah, I'm not hearing those from US, those from India, those from Canada, Caribbean. I'm not hearing them singing. Hello, Madonna. Ah, ah, hello. So you are glorious. So glorious in your way. Lift up your voice, somebody. Tell God, Father, you are glorious because the glory of God, of God is about to descend. So you are glorious. So glorious in your way, you are faithful, so faithful in your ways. The Bible says some trust in horses and chariots, but we who do not trust in horses, the songwriter says, you do not lie, you do not fear, war is hard for you to do. He doesn't exist, so he, he can never, never exist. So you do not lie, you do not fear. War is hard for you to do. He doesn't exist, so he can never, never exist. So the songwriter says, According to your knowledge and your will for me, what you say you have done, I just need to align them. Because you are no man that changes your mind, oh, oh. Those that know you, we trust in you, nor in horses and chariots. By the arm of flesh, no man can prevail. No man, no man, no man, no man. My confidence is you, Jesus. What is hard? What is hard for you? It can never Never exist, oh, you do not lie, you do not fear, what research for you to do? It doesn't exist, so oh. it can never, never exist, so oh. Father, we give you glory. Lord, we give you honor. We give you adoration for tonight. It is a privilege and not a right that we are gathered here today to receive your word. Therefore, we invoke your presence. Therefore, we call you Father to take authority. Tonight, in the name of Jesus, we join the 24 elders. We wave our hands unto you and we say, Hosanna unto your holy name. Father, we make a decree on this altar that as we stream Makaduna Kada, for as many that are under the sound of my voice, as your word come out, Makade, Mina Kolabadi Sakata. I pray that no one will go back the same. Lord, you say your word is the most sure word of prophecy. Let this word be the most sure word of prophecy in the life of somebody. Let this word be an evidence of testimony. I made a decree in the life of somebody. I made a decree. Mekodina Kazabada, Mofiana Kasum Naia, Zute Yabadosha. I pray for somebody watching and connecting that you will not leave this auditorium the same. You will not leave this live stream the same because. The word of God is about to visit you for in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. God bless you. Samantha, God bless you. In the name of Jesus. Mark chapter number five. Everybody put it at the comment section. God bless each and everyone joining. Hallelujah. It's time. It's time. Can somebody type it at the comment section? Are you ready? Are we ready? Are we ready? If you're ready, type it at the comment section. I am ready. I am ready. I want to see how many people are connecting. Hallelujah. 
I want to see how many people are ready for the next level. If you're ready, type it at the comment section. It's time. It's time. Hallelujah. I'm seeing 30 people watching me. Only seven likes. Praise Master Jesus. I don't know how many people have shared. Can we do it to like and share? God bless you. Now me river in the name of Jesus. If you're watching me, type it at the comment section. It's time. If you're with me, type it at the comment section. It's time. It's time. As you're typing, if, if you have no like and share, kindly click on the three dot button at your top right for liking and sharing in the name of Jesus. Somebody put it at the comment section. It's time. It's time. It's time. It's time. Hallelujah. Only Nana Frank. Oh my God, God bless you, Nana Frank. God bless you, Samantha. In the name of Jesus, it's time. Praise Master Jesus. Oh, God bless you, Naomi River. In the mighty name of Jesus, it's time for us to receive the word of God. It's time for us to receive the word of God. In the name of Jesus, somebody put it at the comment section. It's time. It's time. Hallelujah. Mark, Acts, oh my God, Mark chapter number five. Somebody put it at the comment section. Mark chapter number five. Mark chapter number five. We are going to read from verse 21. Hallelujah. Mark chapter number five. We are going to read from verse 21. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. Can we do it to like and share? Everybody, Mark chapter number five. Something is happening here today. Something is happening. Something is happening. Mark chapter number five. Mark chapter number five. Mark chapter number five. Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. Mark chapter number five. Can somebody like it? Like and share, like and share. Mark chapter number five, verse 21. Somebody put it at, at the comment section. Just type in Mark chapter number five. Just type in Mark chapter number five in the name of Jesus. Just type it at the comment section. Mark chapter number five in the name of Jesus. I'm going to read from verse 21 to 25. Praise Master Jesus. From verse 21 to 25. Pay attentively as I read in the name of Jesus. Verse 21 says, When Jesus had again crossed over by boat to the other side of the lake. A large crowd gathered around him while he was by the, by the lake. Verse 22. Then one of the synagogue leaders named Jarius came and when he saw Jesus, he fell at his feet. Verse 23. He pleaded earnestly with him my little daughter is dying in other words my little daughter is sick in other words by marriage is dying in other words poverty is about to kill me in other words the sickness is about to take my life that was what Jario said next point says please come and put your hand on her so that she will be healed and live. What is it that you need Jesus to put your hands on? Verse 24. So Jesus went with him. A large crowd followed and pressed around him. Verse 25. And a woman who was, oh my God, who were, who had been subject to bleeding for 12 years. Mari Kabadoshi Kadina Kaza. We are going to stop from verse 25. Praise Master Jesus. Then let's read. Let's continue from verse 35. From verse 35. It says, verse 35 says, Why Jesus is speaking? Oh my God. This is testimony time. Why Jesus was still speaking? Some people come from the house of the Jarius, the synagogue leader. Your daughter is dead. They said, why bother teacher anymore? Why bother Jesus anymore? There are people that have tell you, you can never get married. Why wasting your time praying? You can never get a job. Why wasting your time in that job search? Makodina Kaza, Liba Rose Katiala Branta, verse 36. Overhearing, oh my God, Jesus said, overhearing what they said. So Jesus heard the word that the leaders said to Jairus. Jesus told him, do not, don't be afraid. Just believe. Just believe. Verse 37. He did not let anyone follow him except Peter, James, John, the brother of James. You need to stop the crowd. You need to stop the crowd. If not, your daughter will die. Would they crowd the daughter of, 
of this Roman, of this synagogue ruler would have never come back to life. Verse 38. When they come to the home of the synagogue's leader, Jesus saw a commotion with people crying and wailing loudly. Verse 39, he went in and said to them, why all this commotion and wailing? The child is not dead, but sleep. Verse 40, but they laughed at him. They laughed at Jesus. After he put them all out because they laughed at Jesus, he took the child. He took the child's father and the mother and the disciple who were with him and went in where the child was. was. Verse 41, he took her by the hand and said to her, Talita, come, come, which means little girl, I said to you, get up. Verse 42, immediately the, the girl stood up and began to walk around. She was 12 years old. At this, they were completely astonished. Verse 43 and the last. He gave strict order not to let anyone know about this and told them to give her something to eat. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. God bless each and everyone. Can we put our hands together for Master Jesus? Hallelujah. Immediately, can we put our hands together for Master Jesus? God bless you, Prudence. God bless you. Mm -mm -mm. Is it Muyombo? God bless you. God bless you, Taz. God bless each and everyone. Can we put our hands together for Master Jesus? The word of God is about to come out. Somebody celebrate together with me at the comment section. If you are with me, celebrate together. The word of God is about to come out. Let us celebrate my senior partner. We are clapping to welcome my senior partner, my spiritual mentor, my father, my everything, which is the Holy Spirit. I want us to celebrate the presence of the Holy Spirit as he will be leading me today. Let's celebrate my senior partner, my senior partner. Let's celebrate my senior colleague. Let's celebrate the one that has been giving me the knowledge, the strength, the ability, the one that has been, hallelujah, pastor, there is a lot of, hallelujah, praise master Jesus, let's celebrate, let's celebrate in Jesus' mighty name, hallelujah. Somebody say, pastor, there is a lot of fake Jesus, but I'm talking tonight on, on Jesus, the one that died on the cross of Calvary, and I'm talking tonight on what we capture. If you do not stop them now, you will lose something very important. If you do not stop them now, you will lose something very important. Mark chapter number 5, verse 21 says, Jesus came across the lake onto the other side. We have come to pray and encounter God. The Bible says multitude of people follow Jesus. Not everybody that were behind Jesus was for the gospel. Not everybody that were after Jesus wanted to see Jesus preaching the gospel. Some were following Jesus because they wanted Jesus to multiply bread and fish. Some were following Jesus because they wanted to see the miracle of which Jesus Christ is operating. Some were following Jesus because they wanted to clap and cheer for Jesus. Some were touching Jesus to feel the quality of the cloth of Jesus. Some were touching Jesus because they just want to feel the body of that man called Son of David. That is the reason why we can see 44 people watching me. Only 12 people has liked to show to us uh, that not everybody that is here is here for the word of God. <clears throat> There are people that are here tonight for an encounter and there are people that are fighting for this particular encounter not to hold. There are people that whenever they come, they are, they are here to monitor, like they are just here to monitor what we are doing, uh, standing in agreement uh, just to block, just to block the destiny of people. If all of us were here for the gospel of Jesus Christ, not only 13 people could have liked the live stream because you do not pay to like and you do not pay to share. You are sharing for the good of your brother. If you can find it difficult to like a live stream, that is the word of God to share it to your brother. That means something is wrong with you. If you can hear a man of God preaching and intentionally from your heart, you're saying now, I must be following him, but I will never comment. I will never like, and I will never share. Listen to me. You are a spectator behind Jesus. 
Today, I want to talk about people that are no spectators behind Jesus as you begin to pray. Makodina Kaza. Everybody, if you're here for your very first time and you're here for an encounter, I want you to click the three dot button at your top right as you're liking and you're sharing. As the word of God visit us, as the word of God is meeting us in our point of need. If you're here for Jesus, make sure you like and share. Kimbete, God bless you. If you're here for Jesus, you are going to say, man of God, I am here for the gospel. I want the, the gospel to go viral. As you're liking, you're sharing, you're saying, man of God, I am together with you. But one thing for sure, spectator always has their place. And people that are following Jesus with a goal always has their place. Listen to me. The Bible says multitude of people follow Jesus. In the multitude of people, the woman of, of an issue of blood was also there among the crowd. So in the midst of the crowd, everybody has their own problem. What is your own problem? Do not allow another person's problem limit you. Do not allow another person's problem stop you. You, you, you accepted the call for, for Jesus, you alone. And you are here for a purpose and for an encounter. Do not look at what others are doing. If others cannot like the live stream, like. If others cannot share, share. By sharing your sin, Father, I'm standing the gap to push your gospel to go forward. I cannot be able to preach as Pastor Bazi, but I'm standing the gap so that somebody can hear this gospel. The Bible says there was a ruler of the synagogue, a man that was leading the synagogue, a synagogue was a church. A synagogue was a place of worship. There was a man that was leading there. This man was called Jarius. Jarius was a pastor. As today we have a lot of pastors. Maria is a pastor. David is a pastor. Ephata is a pastor. Kimbeta is a pastor. Everybody is a pastor. Anywhere you are called, that is your own pastoral field. Praise Master Jesus. This man was leading the church. Jarius could pray for people. People could get healed. But he, it came his own time that his daughter was sick. He lay hands on the daughter. There was nothing going. He fasted and prayed. There was nothing. When Jarius heard that Jesus Christ is coming, Jarius said, no, this sickness of my daughter is above me. If I do not go to Jesus, my daughter will die. Jarius knew the grace of which he is submitted under. Today, proud has caused a lot of ministers, lost properties, lost a lot of things in their life because the thing that they can do it on their own. In the realm of the spirit, there is what we call the atmosphere. In the realm of the spirit, there is what we call grace. Whenever you come across a particular thing that is above you, make sure, make sure you submit under the higher authority. There are people that has just grown up from nowhere as minister. They don't value their spiritual fathers. There are people that just grew up from nowhere as minister because you can hold the mic, pray, and speak in tongues. It does not mean that you can uh, you can stand and insult the fathers or stand and insult people that have been serving God before you were born. Like now, what I'm seeing on social media, you will see young boys, children that are not even up to 35, they're insulting father that has been preaching the gospel for more than 60 years. Before you were born, the man was reading the Bible and preaching the gospel. Now you are just 40 years of age, 30 years, and you want to fight against somebody. That is, that is, the dedication with God is above your age. Be careful. I have come to speak to somebody. Jarius taught us something that in any situation, we need to swallow our pride and humble. We need to swallow our pride and humble ourselves. The Bible says, this man called Jarius, when he heard of Jesus, he ran to Jesus in the midst of the multitude. He was not ashamed. There are people that are ashamed. That is the reason why they are blocked in their problem. There are people that are ashamed. That is the reason why you are still suffering. You are ashamed to go before Jesus and say, Jesus, I am ready to make a U-turn. A lot of us are ashamed. Jarius went and fell down. The Bible says he saw Jesus and fell down on his feet. And he begged Jesus and said, Master, my little daughter lies at the point of death. I beg thee, come and pray the heart. Come and lay your hands so that my daughter can believe, can live again. Jesus looked at Jarius. Jesus said, are you not the pastor? Jarius said, I'm a pastor. But Jarius knew that with Jesus, Jesus is 
is the supreme of all pastors. Jesus is the senior authority. If there is any problem that is above you, submit it to Jesus. The Bible says, Jesus said, my fellow colleague cannot come down, come before me and beg for me. Then I refuse to go. Jesus told Jairus, get up, let us go to your house. As they were going, the Bible says the woman of an issue of blood was in that venue. He heard Jesus telling Jairus, let us go, let me go and pray for your daughter. The woman of an issue of blood was there. It was like a crusade ground. There are a lot of people watching me. Everybody has their own problem. The woman has blood issue. Jairus' daughter was sicker. They were blind and so many people. But G Jesus said, let us go. The woman of an issue of blood heard the way Jesus said, let us go. The woman said, if I allow Jesus to go today, I will never have a privilege to meet with Jesus again. So I need to activate my faith so that my faith cannot only be so that my, my faith cannot only be for Jesus praying for me. Let my faith increase in the way that if only I can touch the garment of Jesus, I will make whole. Somebody, I don't know if you came tonight by faith. What is that problem that you are passing through? If you came tonight before the Lord by faith, believe me, you cannot leave this present the same. You cannot leave this atmosphere the same because God will be doing something powerful in your life today. Because God will be changing your situation. You cannot come before the Lord in such an atmosphere and you go back the same. I have come to speak to somebody that that particular seed that the enemy have planted into your family and in your life, I uproot it in the name of Jesus. I made the decree in the life of somebody. God bless, God bless you, mommy, Betty Willemann. I met a decree in the life of somebody. Listen to me. There shall be no loss in the name of Jesus. I met it clear. There shall be no loss. There shall be no loss. What are you waiting God? What are your expectations? I have not come to talk about the woman of an issue of blood. I have come to talk about Jarius. About Jarius. The Bible says, as the woman touched Jesus, Jesus forgot about Jarius. He turned as he was asking the disciple, who touched me? Some of the disciples said, Jesus, a lot of people has been touching you. Jesus said, no, there is a particular hand that just touched me. So if you make up your mind today, you will touch Jesus in the way that nobody has, has ever touched Jesus. Everybody was touching Jesus, but this woman activated her spiritual code, her spiritual faith to touch Jesus. Trusting and believing God for that healing. Jesus was moving was grumbling. Jesus began to say, somebody touched me. I know somebody touched me because virtue has gone out of me. When Jesus told Jairus, let's go, everybody was going with the crowd because they were going to pray for Jairus' daughter. When the woman touched Jesus, Jesus forgot about Jairus. There are people here saying, Pastor Bazi, since I've been in Christ Jesus, Pastor, I've been serving God faithfully for 20 years. Pastor, I've been serving God faithfully for 15 years. Nothing has been going on with me. Pastor, people that came after me, now they are married. Pastor, people come to, to God. People came to me, I pray for them, they are healed. But yet my life has not changed. Pastor, I advise women, the, and God bless them with marriage. Pastor, I pray for women, and they get a job. Why is my own problem the same? Pastor, my life is not changing. There is nothing. Have you been in that situation? That you came to God's face. But people came behind you. They are blessed. You have been in church for 20 years. But people that just came for one year. The man that has been with you for 20 years. They left you and they married them. You are crying every day asking yourself question. Pastor, what is going on? You have been asking yourself question. Listen to me. I bring you good news. I bring you good news. Are you ready to touch Jesus? If you're ready to touch Jesus, start by touching your like button. Start by touching your like button by telling Jesus, I am liking this live stream to share. I have seen women that came to me. A woman came to me and said, Pastor, I pray for people, they all get jobs. But me, I don't get job. I advise women and they are, they, they are married. Today, I am not married. Pastor, what is going on? That is actually what happened. But Jarius never get angry. Jarius never get angry to live. Never you leave the presence thought of God. Because waiting time before the before God is not wasted time. As you are waiting on God, you are not wasting your time. The Bible says Jarius was there waiting for God. 
He keep on perceiving, persisting, waiting, waiting on God. Jairo was waiting. Jesus was communicating with a woman. When you read Mark chapter number five, from verse 25 to 34, 10 verse, Jairus was coming, Jesus was communicating with a woman of an issue of blood. Jairus was there. He never said, let me go back. He never said, let me change church. He never said, let me go and fast and pray. He never said, no, I came first. Listen to me, child of God. The problem is not by you walking on all social media platform. You, you meet Pastor Paul today. You meet Pastor John today. You meet Pastor everywhere on social media you are available. You cannot wait on God in everywhere. Listen to me. There must be a grace of which you are under. Passion. They wait on God at a particular space, spot. You don't wait on God everywhere. Samuel waited on God at a particular place. Abraham waited on God. Where are you waiting, waiting on God? Pastor Bazi is preaching here. You want to be blessed here. You are watching about four or five lives at the same time. You are here, you are here, you are here, you are here, you are here. Everybody pray for you. You don't know whether the prayer they are praying for you, is it a good prayer or bad prayer? Not everybody calls your name. Not everybody declare what's upon your life because words are powerful. If I call your name and I say, Fan on Samuel, automatically I am addressing Samuel and the word is coming directly to, to Samuel. Any word that I'm speaking to Samuel, Samuel must take a response. Serious. We need to be very, very careful. Have you become a spiritual prostitute? Everywhere you're there. Is that where God asks you to be? Is that where Jesus placed you? You need to wait on God where he placed you. If you are everywhere, listen to me, you cannot see God everywhere. The Bible said, they that wait upon the Lord. It's a place of battle and patience. Listen to me. Though you came here first, though you have been in, in this channel first, though you, 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 you have been here for, 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 for one year, there are people that can just join today and God locate them. Be here. Decide not to go. Though Pastor Bazi pray for you, though they have prayed and fasted and prayed, nothing is happening. Be here. The devil just wants you to go. Jarius was there. The Bible said Jesus forgot about Jarius. There are people that Jesus has forgot about you. Listen to me. No matter how worse your situation is, if you're before the Lord, you cannot be forgotten. Before we pray, the Bible says something happened. Something happened before Jesus remembered Jarius. Let us read verse 35. This is what happened. Verse 35 says, verse 35. Why Jesus was still speaking to who? To the woman of an issue of blood. From verse 25, 26, 27, 10 verse, Jesus forgot about Jairus. 10 years, 20 years. There are women here crying for God, telling God, Father, I need a husband. 10 years, you have been asking God for a husband. 20 years, you have been asking God for the house. Where are you asking God for? Are you still in the presence of God or you are everywhere? If you're everywhere, come back. Jairus was there. Now listen. Verse 35 says, Why Jesus was still speaking to the woman of an issue of blood? Some people come from the house of Jairus. So some people came from the house of Samuel to tell Samuel, Samuel, do you know as you are praying together with Pastor Bazi every day, as you are waiting on Pastor Bazi, Samuel, do you know that your daughter is dead? Somewhere, do not worry, Pastor Bazi, any longer. Let us go somewhere. We are going to bury your daughter. Let us go somewhere. People came and they're saying, Somewhere, don't worry. I will buy coven somewhere. Don't worry. I will give you one million US dollars somewhere. Don't worry. We are going to contribute for you somewhere. Don't worry. We are going to buy coven. We are going to dig the grave. We are going to, to do party. That is what people will tell you when things go worse. People just want you to, 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 to move. That is why they came and they told Jarius, don't worry the master any longer. Your daughter is dead. Let's go. We are already digging the grave. Listen to me. If Jarius was not waiting on God, if Jarius was not there, they could have buried the daughter. But as Jarius was waiting on Jesus at that particular place, Jesus heard the word that was spoken to, 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 to Jarius. Jesus turned and remembered that, oh, I forgot about Nami River. 
Oh, I forgot a father was still here. Oh, I forgot David was here. Oh, I forgot. Where are you calling on Jesus? If Jesus turned today to look, would, will, will Jesus see you where he, where he placed you? Will Jesus see you? That is the question I am asking somebody. That is the question. Jesus heard Jarius. Jesus told Jarius, do not believe. Do not be afraid. Only believe. We are living in a life whereby if Betty William is sick today, nobody will come to give Betty William $10. If Betty William has a problem today, nobody will show up. But let me tell you, if Betty William died today, everybody will post her picture. Some will come and they will start saying she was a good girl. They will start giving out money. Some will say, no, they will post her picture everywhere. How many people is posting you today? How many people are posting your picture today? How many people check on you today? How many people? How many people has already walked to you like this and said, Betty Willie, have you eaten today? Fan on Samuel, have you eaten? Hey, Father, what is your problem? Can I encourage you? Where were all these people when Jarius' daughter was sick? Where were all these people when David was, was having the problem? Now they were not there. They saw when Naomi River was suffering. They saw where Father was suffering. They saw when King Bete was crying and suffering. But nobody came there to say, take your daughter to the hospital. They waited for your situation to grow worse. They waited for the daughter to die. As the daughter died, they came and opened their, their crocodile face, pretending to you that they love you. Listen to me. The devil does not love us. The devil can never show us mercy. A lot of us, the devil pretend. Those people that are moving around us are pretenders. 99% of those people around us, they are pretending, saying they love you. Oh my God, pastor, I will send you a, a, a message. God to go to work. Hallelujah. Okay. God bless you, mommy, Betty William, in the name of Jesus. A lot of people are pretending. They are pretending. Hallelujah. I'll pray for Ashley at the end of the, the live stream. A lot of people are pretending. They are pretending. Ah, Nana Fran. How many, how many people you call your friend Nana Fran? How many of them has checked on you today? How many of them has asked you, how is your health? Nobody. But if you die today, they'll be the first people to post Nana Fran everywhere. Some will use your death to create content to, 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 to make money. Oh my God. Nana Fran was a good person. Oh my God. He was a good person. Oh my God. I remember how he did. I remember when Nana Fran needed a rice, just a cup of rice to eat. How many people? The Bible says, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagle. If you want your strength to be renewed, you will wait on God at the waiting place. Do not be everywhere. God can call you that you have left that particular position. It will take another time for God to call you. Listen to me, people of God. Now, when Jarius told Jesus that my daughter is sick, the first time, Jesus said, let's go. Jesus asked everybody to go with the crowd. But when the daughter of Jarius died, Jesus stopped the crowd. Jesus taught us something here. That to heal the sick is a different level of miracle. To raise the dead is a different miracle. Hallelujah. Somebody should, somebody should listen to this. Praise Master Jesus. Listen, verse 22. Somebody should understand this story very well. I want somebody to learn something. This is a very technical point. It will help you grow. Mark 5.22 says, Then one of the synagogue leaders named Jairus came, came, and when he saw Jesus, he fell at his feet. Verse 23 says, He pleaded earnestly with him, My little daughter is dying. Please come and put your hands on her so that she may live and she may be healed. Verse 24 says, So Jesus went with him, and a large crowd followed and pressed him around. So Jesus was going to pray for Jairus' daughter with the crowd. Everybody understand. Now, let's go to verse 30. 
Let me see verse 35. Listen verse 35. Verse 35 says, While Jesus was still speaking, some people came from Jairus' house. Oh my God, from Jairus, uh, from, from the house of Jairus, the synagogue leader, uh, uh, the synagogue leader say, your daughter is dead. They said, why bother the master anymore? Verse 36 says, overhearing what they said to Jairus, told him, don't be afraid of uh, only believe. Verse 37, then he did not let anyone correct. This is the point. This is the point. Verse 37 says, Jesus, he did not let any, anyone follow him except Peter, James, and John, the brother of James. So Jesus did not let anybody follow him except Peter, James, and John. The three people among the multitude, when we talk of multitude, multitude means thousands of people. Among the multitude, he stopped everybody. He stopped his disciples. He chose only Peter, James, and John. Why, why were Jesus going for the first time with all the crowd? And verse 37, he's stopping the crowd. This is Jesus going to pray for a sick patient, saying with, with the multitude. Now the daughter is dead, he's stopping the crowd. These are two cases, two, two, two problems, two different miracles. Listen to me, child of God. You cannot just sleep and eat your shawarma or pizza. Then you think that you walk across that problem. You just say, demon, go, and the demon, go. No. Listen to me. There are people in your life that you need to say no to them. There are people you need to look into their face, Dorian, and say, stop. There are some friends you need to cut off with them. There are some phone number in your phone that you need to block it. You need to delete it. Listen. For you to be able to say stop, it takes a different dimension. For Jesus to look at the multitude of people and say, stop, it took him courage. Jesus knew that I was going to pray for the sick. Now is to raise the dead. The same energy it takes to, to, uh, to, to heal the sick is not the same energy it takes to raise the dead. One guy came to me and told me, Pastor, pray for me. I was initiated. I told the guy, you must explain to me everything that happened. You cannot just say, I, I was initiated. I want to know the name of your leader, when and how, for how long. You, I need to know everything. Because if you do not expose everything, no, pray, I am limited. Because when you are exposing the truth, you render it powerless. Jesus stopped the crowd. Do you know why you are not married? It's because of the crowd. Do you know why you have not gotten a job? It's because of the crowd. Do you know why any man has not asked you out? It's because of the crowd. Do you know why you are not here yet? It's because of the crowd. Do you know why things are not moving on with your life? It's because of the crowd. You hold the hands of everybody. You want to pray. You're asking God for a husband. Lord, I need a husband. You alone, 20 pastors on YouTube, knows that your prayer point is a husband. Ah, 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 ah. You need a job. Everybody on social media knows. But the good pastor, the bad pastors, I don't care to know. That means anybody you see in the name of prayers, you tell them, I, I, I am single. I need help. Ah, ah. Stop. I said, stop. Somebody listen to me. It's not all about fire and thunder. God bless you, Elvira. It's not all about fire and thunder. Listen to me. You must say, stop. Do not be, do not, do not be. No. Stop. To say stop, it takes bonus. You are living in a in a in a closed partition in a in a, in a house whereby your your neighbors can hear your voice every day. You carry your your every day you carry your big big Bible. You are shouting, "Oh God, give me a husband! God, that husband must come to the God." Everybody in your area knows that your prayer point is is husband. Ah ah, spiritual prostitute. 
You are praying God for, for, for say for a, a, a job. You are there. You want everybody to know, oh God, no, there is something about black. All social media, they knows you. They knows you. God does not move that way. God does not move that way. You need to say stop. Listen to me. If you want to move forward, you need to say stop. I myself, I decided to say stop to so many things. Hallelujah. Listen, hear me. If you want to get that husband, listen to me. Take your phone. Take your phone. Check your messages. You don't know yourself. Praise Master Jesus. I, I Listen, you can fake yourself to people. You cannot fake yourself before a man of God. There are a lot of people here. God is telling me, you, you, you don't know yourself when you are in public or you are on a live stream like this. The real you is when you are alone in your house, when you have shut your door. The real you is when you are just in texting alone. The real you is the is the thing that you are doing in the hidden place alone. The real you is when you are alone. Ah, some people think that they'll come before the, the man of God and lie. Make Odina Kaza. I share with us about one of one of my one of my Christians. That I saw her somewhere. I, I was trying to call her to communicate to her. I just called her. She was like, hello, Papa. Yeah, Papa, please, I travel. She didn't allow me to, to talk. She just said, hey, Papa, I travel. I'm not even in Dubai. I am in Susan so place. I was just calling to, to pass her an information. I was just calling to tell her, this is me. I was just calling to tell her, I saw you. I just wanted to say hi. I wanted to tell you this. She just picked the call. Hello, Papa. Man of God, God bless you. Man of God, I'm not even in town. I travel. I just stood like this. She was there. Blah, 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 blah. I was there watching at her. After she finished, I said, okay, okay. When are you coming back? She said, okay, Papa, maybe, maybe like this. I said, okay, God bless He said, amen. Chai. When I off the phone, I said, chai, Christians. I say even the devil is ashamed because this type of lie is too much. Even the devil, at that particular point of time, even the devil is learning how to lie from them. Oh my God. There was no way. Then suddenly I was crossing the road. She was also crossing the road. Then when she saw me, ah, if there was a way for, for this lady to disappear, if there was a way that she could just disappear, when she saw me, her eyes was open like this. If there was a way for her to break the ground and enter inside, she would just break the ground. She was like, uh, uh, uh. I said, calm down. I, I, I understand. I said, calm down. She was like, uh, I said, calm down. Breathe in, breathe out. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. I know, I know. I said, take it easy. Charity said, Pastor Bazi, don't kill me. Oh. I said, take it easy. Take it easy. It's okay. I, she said, Papa, I, I said, don't explain. I said, I understand. I understand. I said, Chai. That is the war we are living with by now. Child of God, you must say stop to the crowd. You must say stop. The first category of crowd whereby Jesus stopped. Jesus says stop to the crowd. Check yourself. Check your real you, not here. Forget about what you are typing at the comment section. Check your real you. Check the contact in your phone. The contact in your phone, listen to me. Ah, can you be able to unlock your phone and, and give it to Pastor Bazi to check all your conversation on WhatsApp? There are people who say, God forbid, if my phone is my privacy, my phone is my privacy, God forbid. Yes, check yourself. Can you be able to unlock your phone like this? To have a phone without no password? That somebody can just screw, like just manipulate your, your, your phone? Can you be able? Secondly, can you be able to share some of your information with people? If no, check yourself. Say stop. There are some numbers and contacts in your, on your phone that if you keep on keeping them, you will not move forward. You need to say stop. Somebody, after this live stream, you are going to take your phone and delete some numbers. Delete the numbers. Let it go. There are some men that are pretending around you that they love you, they love you, listen. Those men are only there to delay to delay your future. Let it go. There are some women in the life of men. They are just there to delay your future. Let them go. 
You cannot die. Nobody should tell you that if you stay for, 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 for long without having sex, uh, people will say you have a problem with the stomach. It's lie. Big, big lie. Zero over 20. Fake. Do not be, do not be moved with the things of the world. Please. You need to say stop. Look into your phone. Delete some contact. I know God is talking to somebody. There are contacts in your phone. That is why God has not given you the husband. Because of the chat, the chat, there are contact in your phone. That is why you're limited. You need to delete it and, and let them go. People keep on viewing your status every day. Nobody check on you. At least when charity view my status, she will say, hello, pastor. Pastor, that's beautiful. I love it like this. At least she could comment. But there are people that when they view your status, they just view your status. They want to know about your update. And you post a video, you have one 100 view, one comment. That is to show how, how the world is. It's time. Somebody need to say stop. Are you moving with the crowd? Listen to me. With the crowd, the crowd can only take you to the mall for you to eat pizza, ice cream, shawarma, all those type of things. Listen to me. But your head charity and speak a word whenever things are going down. Charity, listen to me. Listen to me. The type of a husband you need charity is a is, is a prayer partner, not a prayer point charity. The man you are believing God, let the man be a prayer point. In the mighty name of Jesus, a prayer partner, not a prayer point. I have come to speak to somebody. Jesus had the bonnet to stop the crowd. Jesus said, stop. He stopped the crowd. People were telling Jesus, hey, master, hey, at least we are following you. Hey, master, no. Jesus, we should just go with you. When you say in Jesus' name, we'll shout amen. Jesus, let's go. We are going to sing praise and worship. Jesus, let's go. So that people will know that you are Jesus. Jesus said, no. I don't need to show myself. Why will you become a celebrity? Why will you why will you like to show everything? You want to do small thing for God. Your shoulder is like this. Eh, you are not even going eh, anyway. I'm a prophet, doctor, pastor, but this one, this one, no. Jesus said, No, the crowd should stop. I don't want the crowd to see. I am not doing the miracle for the crowd. Let the crowd stop. Ah, uh -uh. somebody you are going to say stop. There are some friends that you need to tell them stop. There are some business partners you need to, to, to tell them stop. That person that whenever they come closer to you, the only thing they know how to tell you is that, have you seen this pastor on social media? He's a criminal. He's a pastor like this. This pastor is like this. He's a criminal. Eba Rukata. He's a criminal. He's a criminal. Praise Master Jesus. I have come to tell somebody stop. Now, let us see something. Who did Jesus select? Jesus selected three people, Peter, James, and John. Jesus selected how many people? Three, Peter, James, and John. When he was going to raise the sick, he went with a multitude of people. When he was going to raise the dead, he selected Peter, James, and John, three people. Even in, in his disciple, you were at the age of, you were at the age of 20. You when you were 20 years, when you were asking God for a husband, you could go anywhere. You could neglect him, but listen to me. Now you're 35. Now you are 40. You need to be very careful. At the age of 40, you don't need to behave like a girl of 20 years. At the age of 45, you don't need to pray as a, as a girl of 25 years. Jesus knew that the child was dead. He selected four, Peter, James, and John, to raise the dead. The Bible says, stop the crowd. What are the use of Peter, James, and John? I want us to see. What are the use of Peter, James, and John? Peter was the man after Jesus' heart. Who is the man after your heart? Praise Master Jesus. Who is after your heart? Secondly, who Peter James? Who is James? Jesus knew that James is that person. James is a burden bearer. 
people. James can tell the people, stop crying now. Jesus Christ is here. John is somebody that could tell them, believer, there is nothing God cannot do. He is the God of impossibility. Who, who, you Look into your life, your own Peter, James and John. What are their rules? Oh my God. When your Peter call you, they just call, hello, charity. Are we going to hang out tonight? Yes, so is that your own Peter? When your James call you, hello, babe, where are you? Oh my God, there is one guy that just learned today. We need to cheese somewhere. Are that your own Peter, James and John? Is that the only encouragement they can give you? Something is wrong. Jesus selected people that he knew that they could raise the dead. You need to celebrate somebody. You need to select somebody whereby charity, if you call them that I am sick, they will rush to your place and hold your hands together and begin to speak in tongues. Lord, we hold the hands of charity. We begin to pray. She will not die. Lord, no matter what the doctor have said, uh, kaba, kaba, da, kada. when Peter, James, and John, uh, they reached in Jairus' house, uh, the Bible said everybody was crying out. Uh, Jesus asked them to, to stop. Jesus asked them to stop and send everybody away. And the disciple held their hands. They begin to intercede. Kabakodia, lekete, makodina kasa. They were interceding. Makodina kasa. This child must rise up. Iberina kadua, lebedo sakataya. How many times are your friends praying for you, Lavanya? How many times the people you call your friends? How many times are they praying for you, Tars? How many times are they praying for you, Nana? Oh my God, is it Naomi River? How many times are your friends holding their hands and speaking and speaking positive water upon your life? How many times are your friends those one that just know how to gossip? Something is wrong. I have come to tell somebody you must say stop. I have come to tell somebody you must say stop. In the mighty name of Jesus, you must say stop. We are living in a world whereby if we do not stand strong as Christians, there will come a day whereby people will tell us that there is no God. We are living in a day whereby if we do not stand our gap to press the gospel in all dimensions, there will come a day where people will, will tell us there is no God. But listen to me. Whether they like it or not, there is a God in heaven. Whether they believe me or not, I am not here to be, oh my God, Kisha Angel, God bless you. I am not here for somebody to believe me or not. I am not here to look the comment of people. If you like, you call me useless. If you like, you call me fake prophet. If you like, you call me fake teachers. Listen to me. I might be trying my best and through my effort and I make an error somewhere. God in heaven knows that this is my servant. He is trying for the gospel to be preached. In this particular place, uh, there is an error. God himself knows it is better for you to stand the gap uh, and let there be an error rather than you staying quieter. Uh, listen to me. Make sure you stand the gap. Do not, do not be limited by people's insult. No matter how many people come here and say fake prophet, that is another way to announce you. Hallelujah. How can somebody know you are fake? If you want, if, if you can judge somebody to say he is fake, that means you have tried the person, right? In your kingdom, in the, in the marine kingdom, then you have tried the person. So anyone that is here, you're saying the pastor is fake. That means you have tested him. Hallelujah. How do you know he, he, he is fake? If you are truly a man of God, the Bible says judge not. So if you are truly a child of God and you know the true prophet, if you see fake screw, don't, don't waste your time here because he's preaching nonsense. As you are keeping the type in your fake, you, 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 you are fake. The word I am speaking to their spirit and their life. For you, you will not receive the word as a blessing. The word will become a cancer to your system because you are attacking the man with the updated oil. I tell each and everyone, before you attack a man of God, there is something the, the Lord told me. I was sleeping, the Lord said there will be a sign. This particular sign started happening with me. I think it's four years today. Praise Master Jesus. Whenever I am preaching, there are times that people see me making like this, standing like this. I do not do like this for nothing. Praise the Master Jesus. There was a time the Lord told me, whenever you, you, whenever you feel blood on your, uh, on your uh, left eye, that means be sensitive in the realm of the spirit. Be very careful with your word because I'm about to show you great and mighty things that thou knowest. So whenever I begin to sense such an atmosphere, I pity those texts putting such useless texts at the comment section. 
Listen to me, because at that particular moment, a word can be released that will curse your, your life forever. There are people that come before the presence of the Lord just to attack somebody. You touch them by error. You go back and your life will be down forever. Be careful. Family, be careful to attack a man praying. Be careful. I cannot say Nana Frank, you are fake. Never. Even if Nana Frank is praying with, 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 with empty clothes, that is not my business. He is praying his God. He is doing it the way he believes God. I am not in the position to say Nana Frank is fake. As long as we are still reading the, the, the same Bible, we can only encourage each other pray together as long as it's the word of God. There is no power for you to say Nana Frank is fake. Says who? You that you are judging other, have you been judged? No. You that you are fighting others, have you been, been fought? No. I told somebody, be careful. Somebody attacked me. He was insulting me consistently. Yes, yes, I told him, be careful. Hallelujah. You don't know me. You don't know me. I told him, be careful. Be careful. This guy went out as far as to send me a, a, a one message. He insulted me and sent me a one message, a warning. I got angry. I got angry. I told God, Father, nobody can threaten my life. This guy sent me a message that he would deal with me. He would show me something. Ah, I said, thank you. This is what I was waiting for. Do, do you know why? What happened? I went and print the, the, the message in the, in, the, in the cyber. I went and said, photocopy me this message. They print the message. I burn it well. I put the message inside an envelope. Abaruna Kazar. You cannot understand. You cannot understand. I put the message inside an envelope. I place it on the ground. I use my anointed oil. I pray over it. After the prayer, I put the anointed oil on, the, on, on that particular message. I told God that what this man has declared over my life, thinking that he's operating in the marine kingdom, let it go back to sender. After the prayer, I look for an offering. I went to the Lord. I said, Father, this is my offering. For, this, is, this is my seat for sending back the arrow back to sender. Three days, this guy called me and he was begging. I said, Pastor, please forgive me. I said, I've not done anything to you. He came and he was begging. I said, no, listen to me. Before you attack any, you know the track record of, of that person. In the name of Jesus. I am not just here for entertainment. There is an altar that speaks. Because you can read the Bible. Because you can do like this. No. Child of God, say stop. We have come to pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Are we ready to pray? Are we ready to pray? God bless you, Elvira, in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord sent me to tell somebody tonight to say stop. You are going to say stop in any wrong frame. Anybody that is being sent by your life by the by devil or to destroy or to stop your life, you are going to say stop. Everybody, make sure you're liking and you're sharing as we are praying. We are going to tell them stop. We are going to say stop in the mighty name of Jesus. Are we ready to pray? Somebody lift up your right hand of power and repeat after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus and by the blood of Jesus, I declare and I decree any wrong passenger, any wrong friends in my life, physically, financially, socially, in the name of Jesus, I say stop. Father, stop them. Stop them. In the name of Jesus, somebody lift up your voice and begin to pray. I pray for somebody watching and connecting any wrong relationship in your life that has been delaying your marriage, delay your testimony. I declare and I decree. I say stop. I declare and I decree. I say stop. I declare and I Somebody 
declare and I decree. I say stop into the life of somebody. Anyone that has been assigned into your life, any wrong people, any wrong partner, that man pretending beside you as a man that will marry you, listen to me. I say stop in the name of Jesus. Any friend that is pretending to be your owner, I say stop in the name of Jesus. Anyone that is pretending, I met a decree in the life of somebody. I met a decree. Under grace, I prophesy. I pray for somebody watching and connecting any wrong passenger in your life. I say stop in the name of Jesus. Every wrong passenger in your life. Any wrong passenger. Any wrong friend. Somebody that has been sent into your life by the devil. In the name of Jesus, I say stop. I say stop in the name of Jesus. I say stop in the name of Jesus. Something is happening there. I say stop in the name of Jesus. That person that has been pretending around you in sheep clothing, pretending every day, I say stop in the name of Jesus. I say stop. Anyone that is around you pretending every day, Father, I declare and I decree. I say stop in the mighty name of Jesus. I say stop to any wrong partner. I say stop. Enough is enough. Those people that have been holding your life, those people stopping your marriage, I say stop in the name of Jesus. Jesus, stop the crowd. As I stop the crowd, I open heaven. I open heaven in the life of somebody. I declare open heaven. I declare open heaven as some today. Marco Dina Kaza. I declare open heaven in the life of somebody. Watching and connecting. Shabadea. I declare open heaven. Listen to me. I declare open heaven in the life of somebody. Listen to me. Your life will never remain the same as from today. Every closed door. Marco Dina Kaza. Libaruna Kazibade. Maruna Kaza. Any closed door upon your life by the devil in the name of Jesus, I declare and I decree. I say stop. Every power of witchcraft, mm. every witchcraft upon your life, any witchcraft, any plan of the enemy over your life, listen to me. I declare and I decree. I declare and I decree in the name of Jesus. Any witchcraft that is fighting you in the name of Jesus, I destroy it by reason of tonight's session. Mekodina Kaza Marudia Shata. The Bible says when the people heard what the word that was spoken by the leader of the synagogue house. They told him, don't worry the master any longer. Your daughter is dead. Listen to me. Jesus, remember Jarius. I want to, to speak into the life of somebody watching and connecting her. I want to speak into the life of somebody watching and connecting her. Every dead situation in your life, Everybody, can we do it to like and share? I want to speak into the life of somebody. Any death situation upon your life, any death situation upon your life, I declare and I decree. I declare and I decree in the name of Jesus. It's coming back to life. Is it physically? It's coming back to life. Is it financially? It is coming back to life. Is it socially? It is coming back to life. Is it financially? I make the decree. Every area in your life that you have been experiencing death make kodina kaza i command life i command life i command life in the life of somebody i command life make kodina kazua maride shike dina kabado shikada lepanta katua ma jegedina kare moshiana karedo sabadina kaza i command life in the name of jesus something is happening now oh my god there is a lady under the sound of my voice there is a strong witchcraft over your life. There is a lady over under the sound of my voice. There is a strong witchcraft over your life. It's heavy witchcraft. A heavy witchcraft. The Lord says, the Lord says he's ending the battle today. The Lord is ending that witchcraft today. The Lord is ending that witchcraft today. The Lord says he's stopping the witchcraft. I want to pray for somebody. Any power of witchcraft upon your life. Ah, yakado shika dinakaza. Any power of witchcraft upon your life. In the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree. Any power of witchcraft upon your life. Any power of witchcraft. Haunting and fighting you. I stop it in the name of Jesus.
Mekodina Kaza. They have been using method to attack you physically, spiritually, and financially. When you sleep at night, they are there. When you're at work, they are there. You feel they are present all over your body. Listen to me. The Lord say it's ending today. The Lord say it's end today. The Lord say it's end today. Marco Libado Shakadina Kaza. I pray for somebody watching and connecting up. Any power of witchcraft upon your life, it's end today. It's end today in the name of Jesus. Whosoever that made the covenant with them, whosoever that made the oath that your life has refused to be, to be all right, that your life has refused to move forward, they have been holding your marriage, they have been putting you in pains and tears. I declare and I decree it's end today in the name of Jesus. Weeping and joy for a night, surely joy come again. The Lord is destroying the witchcraft. God bless those, those that are connecting with Sita. The Lord is destroying the witchcraft today. I declare and I decree. It's end today. Oh my God. Karuna Kaza. Jesus told Jairus, only believe. I pray for somebody by your belief and your faith. Right now, Jesus is stepping into your life. Right now, Jesus is stepping into that rejected position. Right now, Jesus is stepping into that area where you, where you have been tight. Right now, Jesus is stepping into that particular area where your village people say you will not step in. Right now, Jesus is making a move. Listen to me. Jesus make a move upon the, the life of Jesus. Or the, 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 upon the life of Jairus. Jesus walked in the family of Jairus. And Jairus' story changed. Listen to me. Anyone planning to bury your father? Anyone planning to bury your daughter? Anyone planning to bury your mother? Anyone planning to bury any member in your family? I declare and I decree, as Jesus step his feet in the name of Jesus, sir, let their plan be reversed back to sender. I declare and I decree, any premature death, merubato shatia makanta katua, I reverse it back to sender. Any premature death, ibaro shada, those that are planning hard, they are going to bury you. Those that are planning hard, they are going to rejoice over your downfall. In the name of Jesus, I come against their plans. I come against their plans in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree, Jesus step his feet in the house of Jarius. He heard people crying. Jesus says, stop. I want to speak into the life of somebody. And Marie, God bless you. Hallelujah. The Daily Wine Press, God bless you. Everybody, can we do it to like and share? Make sure you're liking, you're sharing, and you're subscribing if you're here for your very first time. Jesus entered the house of Jarius. The first thing Jesus said, Jesus says, stop. Jesus says, stop. I want to pray for somebody. Anything that the enemy has planned for you or prepared for you that will cause you shed tears in this year, 2024. Ah! Error, 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 error. Ah, Marobado Shikadina Kaza. Any way the enemy has prepared, any plan that the enemy has for you to share tears, I say error in the name of Jesus. Ah, Baruna Kaza. E Baruna Kadedo Sibadia. God bless you, Kisha Enje. God bless your seat of faith. Marco Dina Kaza. Kisa Kisa Enje. Any arrow of death, oh my God, towards me and my husband. Patrick, oh my God, Marco Dina Kaza. Kisha Enja, I pray for you and your husband. Ibarota Kida Kata. Any arrow of death that has been reversed in your life and your husband. In the name of Jesus. As I made this decree on this altar, I reverse it back to sender. I reverse it back to sender. I build the hash of fire all over you and your family in the name of Jesus. Meko Dina Kaza. Kisha Enja, listen to me. You will walk as your husband, as a wind. Winner. Nobody can see winner. They will not see you. Nobody can stop a winner. They will not stop you and your husband. I declare and I decree. In long life and prosperity, there you will be satisfied. You will save the Lord. I pray for somebody. In Jesus' mighty name, Marco Dina Kaza. God bless everyone connecting with Sita. If you are new, make sure you are subscribing. Jesus says stop. Jesus told everybody in the house of Jairus, stop and go out. Jesus says, stop. Anything that the enemy has prepared for you to cry, Jesus has sent me to say, stop. Any plan of the enemy that will cause you to shed tears again, Jesus is saying, stop. I don't care to know if, if, if the enemy has made their plan that you are going to cry in the hospital, Jesus says, stop. I don't know if the enemy has made a plan that you are going to share tears on the sick bed. Jesus says, stop. 
Anywhere the enemy have said, is it heartbreak? Jesus says, stop. stop. Hey, Baruna Kaza, your days of tears are over. Jesus is saying, stop. Stop, there shall be no tears. Therefore, any plan of the enemy over your life. In this year, 2024, I stand on this altar. In the life of each and everyone watching and connecting, Jesus says, stop. And I send the enemy back to send away wherever they are coming from. Jesus stop everybody. And he shut the door. And he shut the door. Marco Dina Kaza. Vema Kole, God bless you. God bless you, mother. In the name of Jesus. Jesus shut the door. I pray for somebody. Ibarona Kada. Le Kaloba Doba Dina Kaza. I pray for somebody watching and connecting. Ibaruna Kaza. You see this year 2024. You will not share tears or pains. I declare. Nobody under the sound of my voice. Nobody will share any tears or pains. Nobody will share any tears or pains. You will not share tears or pains in the name of Jesus. Ah, my God. You will not share tears or pains in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree. You will not share tears or pains in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for somebody under the sound of my voice. You will not share tears or pains. You will not share tears or pains. I pray for somebody. You will not share tears or pains. No tears or pains in the name of Jesus no tears of pains in this year, in this year as the month of April is going to an end, listen to me you are entering the month of May with a testimony, you are entering the month of May singing a new song and Jesus sent everybody and closed the door I close any door that the enemy have opened over your life I close every any door that the enemy has opened over your life. As you enter the month of April, as the month of May is announcing to come, I close every evil door of the enemy in the name of Jesus. I close evil doors. Any evil door that the enemy has opened upon your life, I shut them in the name of Jesus. I shut them in the name of Jesus. The month of May, is it May? It's your month of breakthrough. You are breaking through with testimony. You see the month of May, you you are breaking through with testimony. The month of May, you are entering with testimony. The month of May, you are entering with joy. The month of May, you are going to celebrate. The month of May is your month of divine encounter. You are going to sing a new song. I open all closed door and all this prayer that you have been praying. Let the prayer all show you at the gate of the month of May. Before you enter the, the, the month of May, let your prayer all show you. Let your prayer usher you, order your footstep and direct you to place of abundant testimony in the name of Jesus. I pray for somebody, Marco Dina Kaza. This month of May, you are breaking through. There are some doors that you don't need to open. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. There are some doors that you don't need to open. There are doors that will break it. That is why the Bible says breakthrough. The miracle that will come your way. You are going to break every closed door. Doors of limitation, you are going to break them. In the name of Jesus. Doors that has been an obstacle upon your life. You are going to break them down. I declare and I decree breakthrough. Doors of breakthrough in the name of Jesus. I break every door. Get of the month of May. Open. Gate of testimony open right now for your children. Gate of limitation be broken today. In the name of Jesus, we are preparing to enter the month of May. Lord, we pray the month of May is the second month of the second quarter of the year. We declare and we decree. La Codina Casa. The doors are open up. Everybody has been believing God for financial breakthrough. I declare and I decree as you're entering the month of May. Money will look for you. Money will look for you in the name of Jesus. In the month of May, you will not lack. As I sweat, you will not sweat. Ibaruna Kaza. As I sweat to make this prayer on this altar, you will not sweat to open any door. The Bible says, ask and it shall be given. Seek and you shall find, knock and the door shall be opened. As you ask, may you receive. As you knock, may the door open. As you seek, may you find. I pray for somebody. You are not going to struggle in the month of May. What are you believing God for? Is it the job? Believe me, the month of May, jobs opportunity. Is it the 
Is it the husband? Believe me. The month of May. Angels are all sharing you where you meet your husband. The month of May is your month of encounter. You are going to encounter your kingdom's power. You are going to encounter your destiny helper. You are going to encounter that person that God destined for you. In the name of Jesus, the month of May is your month. It's your month of testimony. If you have never shared a testimony since this year started, believe me, believe in the word of the prophet. The month of May, you are going to sing a new song. The month of May, you are going to share a testimony. The month of May, you are going to say, surely the God of Pastor Bazi have done it. Surely my God have done it. Surely my God have done it. You are going to sing a new song. In the name of Jesus. I don't know if somebody was came tonight with a particular prayer point. That you want the man of God to speak a word upon your life. Makodina Kaza. Leba wrote Katiala Branta. Oh my God, you can drop your prayer point at the comment section as we are wrapping up. In the name of Jesus. If you came today with a particular prayer point, make sure you drop it at the comment section. Oh my God, God bless you, Vema. God bless you, Mother. God bless your seed. God bless you, Kisha Angel. I pray for those that connected through seed in the name of Jesus. What leaves your hand never leaves you. I pray that your seed are like altars. On this live stream today, in the name of Jesus, may your seed speak as we as you are as we are wrapping up into the month of May. I use your seed like a point of contact. Listen to me. Before you knock the month of May, let your seed usher you. Let your seed stand as usher. To usher you only where you are going to meet money, 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 money. Connection, connection, connection. Listen to me. There will be no hard struggle in the month of May. Makodina Kaza. I pray for each and every one. May. Madoshi Kadina Kaza. Is it po po putema putema say please pray for me? Pray for, for me, brother. Hallelujah. Pray for, for me, brother. Belly, I want to pray for you. Makodina Kaza. I am seeing a lot of battle all over your life, Belly. E barina kaduba de shata. Lebado shata. Belly, I pray for you. I made this decree in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree. As we are wrapping up to enter the month of April, I declare and I decree upon your life, belly. Listen to me. There is something that has been disturbing you since January. You have been struggling to, to let this thing go. But I saw angel of the Lord taking it away from you. As you're entering the month of May, listen to me, belly. Get ready for a new testimony. In the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, Kisha Angel. God bless you, Mommy Vema. In the mighty name of Jesus. I made this decree in the life of each and every one. This month of April. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. What God showed me about April, it was powerful. What God showed me about April, it was powerful. In the mighty name of Jesus. A prayer request. God will favor give, oh my God, of healing. Oh my God. David, I want to pray for you. I pray for healing. I pray for healing. I pray for healing. In the name of Jesus. David, I pray for healing over your life. I declare and I decree. Let the hand of God rest upon you. In the mighty name of Jesus. I met a public declaration today on this altar. Jesus Christ visited the house of Jairus. The daughter of Jairus was 12 years old. The woman of an issue of blood was 12, 12 years old. I use your case to the case of each and every one. I made a decree belly. It is over in the name of Jesus. Makodina Kaza. Oh my God. Kisha Angel said, Oh Lord, grant me my visa. And for my, oh my God, financial breakthrough. For our ministry, oh my God, feet, oh soul in Jesus' name. Kisha Angel, listen to me. There is nothing impossible for our God to do. I want to pray for you, Kisha Angel. Listen to me. As I was reading your message, the Lord told me that is a minor problem. The Lord told me that's a minor problem. Kisha Angel, I want to pray for you. Listen to me. Kada. If I've never spoken a word upon your life, take this word seriously. Kisha Angel, I declare and I decree. Listen to me, Kisha Angel. Oh my God. Evira, God bless your seat. In the name of Jesus. Kisha Angel, I pray for you. Listen to me. That visa, whatsoever that is holding that visa, I know it's not all about prayer. But the widow trouble, the judge in secret, and in the physical, whosoever that is in charge visa, on, on your visa, whatsoever that is needed or, or wheresoever the, the, the process is being delayed, I speak the, plus, the process in the name of Jesus. 
I speak the process in the name of Jesus. Le kabado sakadina kaza. Mazu kadina kadanta katua. In Jesus mighty name. Kisha angel, believe me. Oh my God, you are coming back to sing a new song. In the mighty name of Jesus. I am not in good health. Musa said, I am not in good health. Musa, I pray for you. Oh my God. Prayer for, 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 for oh my God, studies, career. In the name of Jesus, Mizita. Mizita, I pray for your studies. The Bible says we shall be the head and not the tail. I pray that may God lift you above, above the physical realm. May you always be positive in the name of Jesus. And you will bring forth result of testimony in the mighty name of Jesus. Musa, I want to pray for you. I declare God's healing hand upon your life, Musa, in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, Sister Katie. Sister Katie, I, I want to pray for you for open doors. Sister Katie, hallelujah. Sister Katie, I want you to make up your mind that the month of May will not be as the four first months of, of this year. Sister Katie, the four first months of this year, I'm seeing you struggling a lot. Sister Katie, the first four months, praise Master Jesus. The first four months has been a month of struggle. The Lord says the month of May, he's, he's making a way for you. The Lord said the month of May, Sister Kate, he's making a way for you in the name of Jesus. Prudence, God bless you. Financial breakthrough. Oh, financial breakthrough. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for the disappointment to end prudence. In the name of Jesus. Promises and faith. Promises and faith is ending in the name of Jesus. Anne Marie Edward, God bless you, Anne Marie. I pray for you, Anne Marie, as this month is ending. Let your days of pain end in the name of Jesus. Elvira, I pray and I declare and I decree, Elvira, listen to me. People came and told you at your face, Elvira, that this is how you are going to end up. They spoke it to your face. They mock at you. They mock at you. They mock at you. Listen to me. Their words cannot come to pass upon your life. Anyone that declare any negative word upon your life, Elvira, I declare on this altar in the name of Jesus. As this morning is wrapping up, listen to me. The Lord is wrapping every disappointment in your life. Every disappointment in the name of Jesus. Mekodina Kaza. I pray for your granddaughter. I pray for healing in the name of Jesus. I pray for healing in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God, take me out for pain. Oh my God, on my leg in the name of Jesus. Kalumba, Kalumba. I pray for that pain. Oh my God, is it James? If any one of you is sick, call for the head of the state. I declare and I decree Kalumba. Let that pain hear my voice. Let that pain hear my voice. Hallelujah. Oh my God, and live in the mighty name of Jesus. My, oh my God, somebody said, that's my daughter. Oh my God, won't have to struggle trying to, oh my God, obtain her bachelor degree. Oh my God, is it Cherry? Cherry Compel, I pray for your daughter, no struggle. The Lord is making the crooked path straight. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, the Lord is making the crooked path straight. In the name of Jesus. Makodina Kaza, Libaros Katia Labranta. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, God bless you, Taz. God bless you, Naomi River. Pastor, my husband had a dream, hallelujah, and is in line, oh my God, with the words in the session today. Oh my God. So the word, the word today was just a confirmation to the dream. I want to pray. Praise Master Jesus, Naomi River. I want to pray in the mighty name of Jesus. As Jesus stopped the crowd, Jesus make a move. Jesus stepped into the house of Jarius. Everybody touched Jesus. Everything changed. I pray for you, Naomi River. Everything is changing in your life. Everything is changing for your good. In the mighty name of Jesus. Everything is changing. Hallelujah. Thank you, Pastor Bazi. I have been running and, and up, oh my God, and repeating pastor's life. Been doing my best. Oh my God. I want to pray for you. Is it close set of prayers? Close set of prayers. I pray for you. Praise Master Jesus. The Lord says you need to focus. Hallelujah. You need to focus. Close set of prayers. I am seeing you trusting God, trusting God in so many things. And I've seen you lost several encounters. Whenever God wants to speak to you, God does not see you where he has placed you. Hallelujah. God is asking you to be at a particular spot. God is asking you to wait for him at a particular spot. Be patient. In the mighty name of Jesus, close set. I pray for you that let what God has promised for you, hallelujah, not pass you by in the mighty name of Jesus. Samuel, Salem, say pray for my son. I pray for your son, Salem. His name is Samuel. As I call your name, Samuel, hear the voice of the Lord. Whatever abnormal thing in your system is coming back normal in the mighty name of Jesus. 
God bless you, Kim Bethel. God bless each and everyone in the mighty name of Jesus. Make sure you don't go. You don't go without a prayer point. Hallelujah. Big boss. Big boss, God bless you. Big boss, God bless you. Big boss. I am seeing the Lord asking me to pray for, for couples. Big boss. I'm hearing the Lord asking me to pray for couples. I'm seeing a male and a female. God is asking me to pray for a man and a woman. In the name of Jesus, big boss. Hallelujah, big boss. I'm seeing a man and a woman God is asking me to pray for. Hallelujah. I don't know if these people are to get married or they are already married, big boss. Hallelujah. May God bless everyone of you asking for financial breakthrough with, in the name of Jesus. Oh, Elena, God bless your seat in the name of Jesus. Elena, Oropa, God bless your seat in the name of Jesus. Where is big boss? Where is Big Bulls? In the name of Jesus. Big Bulls. The Lord asked me to pray for unity. I don't know why. For unity. For unity. A lot of battle and separation. Big Bulls. Where is Big Bulls? In the mighty name of Jesus. Big Bulls. Hallelujah. But maybe it's already okay. God is doing something. In the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, Kisha Angel. God bless you, Juan. God bless you, Kim Bethel. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you, Mom. Oh my God, Verma. God bless you, Verma. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you, Brandon. I had an energy years. Oh my God. Brandon, it is well. In the mighty name of Jesus. Brandon, it is well. Believe God for restoration. Hallelujah. Brandon, believe God for restoration. Praise Master Jesus. Our God can be late, but he's late to make you the latest. Brandon, I pray for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Whatsoever thing that you have lost in the past, may God restore it back to you in the name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. I pray for breakthrough, Salem, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Confident, God bless you. God bless you. My confidence is in you. Confident, God bless you. Charity, God bless you. I will keep on speaking on this altar until the day you, you will call me charity. It is done. Hallelujah. The Lord asked me to give you time, charity. I keep on telling God, Father, I pray for your daughter, charity. The time is still ticking. The time is going, Lord. Remember your daughter. Remember your daughter, Father. Before this year goes to an end, Father, may I hear positive news from, from your daughter, charity, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I pray for this person that is coming to Cause pain and tears, put her in pains and tears. That let this person, hallelujah, be taken away. Hallelujah. Let a wind blow and shift any negative things that is coming to make put charity on pains. In the mighty name of Jesus. Glory to Master Jesus. God bless you, charity. In the name of Jesus. Charity, wait on God faithfully. Okay, it is done. God bless you, confident. In the name of Jesus. There is one testimony I am waiting from you, confident. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Confident, I saw you giving a testimony, but you didn't know whom to give the glory to. I saw you with a with a with a with a the certificate like a document, confident. I saw you with a document of congratulation, a document of good news, and you're holding the document. I saw a lot of people asking you, I will be the one to, 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 to take the glory. I'll be the one to take the glory. But the greatest and the and the good thing is that the testimony is coming your way. In the mighty name of Jesus. The testimony is coming your way. In the mighty name of Jesus. The testimony is coming your way. For in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. God bless you, Helena. Hallelujah. Helena, I want to pray for you, Helena. In the mighty name of Jesus. The works of your hands. I rebuke the devourer. May God enlarge your cause. The Bible said this. Affliction shall not rise again. It will not repeat itself again, Helena. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Anne Marie Edward. I pray for you, Anne Marie Edward. As you step into the month of May and Mary Edward, this month of May will be a, re a remarkable month in your life in the month in this year 2024. In Jesus' mighty name. God bless you, Tonya. God bless you, Tonya. In the mighty name of Jesus. The celebration coming your way, Tonya. I declare and I decree it will not pass you by. In the mighty name of Jesus. May Kodina Kazar. God bless you, Mr. Kat. In the name of Jesus. God bless you, Young. Young Naga, Young Naga, I pray for your soul. May God, who is the author and finisher of everything, may God, may God, may God step in right now. Let the attack, let the attack end in the name of Jesus. Let the attacks end in the mighty name of Jesus. Kisha Angel, get ready, get ready, Kisha Angel. Hallelujah. Though it might take a time, it will surely come to pass. God is not a man to lie.
Hallelujah, Kisha Angel. You are going to come back here with a testimony for in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Kisha Angel, do not give up. Hallelujah. You are, you, you are very committed and a good woman. Hallelujah. God sees you, your heart and God will always reward your heart in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless each and everyone for in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Glory to Master Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. If, if I'm not praying for you, make sure you drop a prayer point at the comment section. I pray for you as we wrap up in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, family. God bless you, family. If you have not yet subscribed, make sure you are subscribing. If you have not yet joined, make sure you are joining so that whenever I'm live, you'll be notified. You join us on time. Let us pray for in Jesus' mighty name. God bless you, family. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you, family, in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you, all people of God. God bless you. God bless you, confident. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Make sure you drop a prayer point at the comment section before you go. In the name of Jesus. God bless you, Lilian. God bless you, Lilian. God bless you. God bless you, Taz. Hallelujah. Pray for my sister. Oh, my God. China, please. China, I, I call your name on this altar as a prophet of God. I declare and I decree you cannot be under grace and your disgrace. One is saved in the family, the whole family is saved. I used to like a point of contact to your sister that let this same atmosphere rest upon your sister in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Pray for my children be saved. Oh my God, is it me, Jay? I pray for your children that are gift from the Lord. I cover your children with the precious blood of Jesus. I cover your children with the precious blood of Jesus. Let the hand of the Lord rest upon your children for in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Wow. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh my God. If you were blessed tonight, we are going to stop your family. Oh my God. If you were blessed tonight, hallelujah. Oh my God. And you're saying, Pastor, I was blessed. Make sure you drop a comment. Oh my God. If you want to, go to sow a seed in the mighty name of Jesus, the Lord told me that tomorrow will be our fruitful Saturday. Hallelujah. Tomorrow will be our fruitful Saturday. We are going, and tomorrow is I, the last Saturday of the month. I heard the Lord says our fruitful Saturday. Please, everybody, when you are coming tomorrow, get a fruit. Get a fruit that is sweet. If you are getting a, a mango, don't get a sour mango. Don't get a mango that you bite it and do like this. Hallelujah. Get a sweet fruit. Everybody tomorrow, hallelujah. Please, can we subscribe? God bless you, mommy and father, in the name of Jesus. Please, as you're coming tomorrow, get a fruit. Get a sweet apple. Get a banana. Get anything that is fruit, that is sweet. Get it. Don't get limes. Or citron. Something that when I say suck it, you suck it like you start doing like And if I ask you to prophesy that as this fruit is sweet, you'll be doing like this. You will not be able to, to prophesy because it's sour. Get something sweet. Tomorrow is our fruitful Saturday, which is the last Saturday of the month. It's going to be powerful. Mommy Vema is loving. Hallelujah. So tomorrow, I don't only want to do it once. We are going to do it on our morning session, on our evening session. So on our morning session, we are going to do the fruitful service. So we are going to do it both in the morning and in the evening. So tomorrow, so that those that might not be able to join in the morning, they will also join in the evening. So get a fruit. If possible, get a banana. Get a banana. Correct banana. When you want to get a banana, get don't go and look a, a premature banana. Get a good banana like this one. A good banana that is looking good. You want to buy apple? Don't go and buy apple that is as if it's a rejected apple. Get a get a good apple that is well. Praise Master Jesus. Anything you want to use tomorrow, get the quality one. Buy a good banana. Buy a good apple. If it's any fruit, any fruit, anything that is sweet, get a quality one. Sweet fruit. Hallelujah. Everybody get a sweet fruit tomorrow. For those that will join morning and evening, they will be blessed. It will be a powerful session tomorrow. It's the last Saturday. So tomorrow is the last Saturday. And we'll never see another last Saturday in the month of April. So we are entering the month of May. We want to take over the remaining days and the month of May that it must be sweet and fruitful. If you miss tomorrow's service, ah, I don't know. I don't know. So tomorrow, family, please make sure you come on time. I'm going to share the live stream now. Do not miss. In the mighty name of Jesus, do not miss. Tomorrow is going to be powerful. Hallelujah. Tomorrow is going to be powerful. Our life must be fruitful. Listen to me. That marriage tomorrow, listen, we are going to provoke the husband. We are going to provoke the husband. So get fruit. As much as you can, get the fruit. 
Even we, we bless it or give it to your children, you and your husband, everybody eat it in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Uh, the, it will be 4 p.m. Dubai time. So I'll be live tomorrow, 4 p.m. Dubai time. I will share the live stream now so that everybody can see. It's a fruitful service tomorrow. A fruitful service. One of the most powerful service of this month tomorrow. Do not miss your encounter in the mighty name of Jesus. If you have not subscribed, make sure you subscribe so that when I'm live, you'll be notified automatically. You join us. Let's pray in the mighty name of Jesus. So please, family, can we do well right now? If you were blessed, you want to join others. Hallelujah. By, by saying thank you, Jesus, for everything. Yes, 4 p.m. Dubai time. That is the time that I'll be live. I'll try maximum 4 p.m. Dubai time. I'll be live. So 4 p.m. Dubai time, you can search it up, uh, according to your timing. What is 4 p.m. Dubai time? It's morning in the U.S. time. It's about 8 p.m. in the U.S. time. So in the morning, it's our fruitful service. Hallelujah. We are tired. January, February, March, April, the same thing. No, we are entering May in another dimension in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The culture of heaven is blessing everyone. If you were blessed, you're saying, man of God, I want to give my offering. You can uh, quickly do so at the comment section. You can do so as you click on the uh, dollar sign button or you are doing it through the PayPal. The PayPal link is on this platform. God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus. I want to pray for each and every one. Father, we thank you for today. We give you glory and honor for in Jesus' name. Lord, we are preparing for our fruitful service tomorrow. I declare and I decree no more struggle as we glit on the wings of the Spirit. Our life is sweeter than honey. Our needs are supplied in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree again no more struggle as we glit on the wings of the Spirit. Our life is sweeter than honey. Our needs are supplied for in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. God bless each and every one family. God bless you, people of God. God bless you for in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Thank you for coming. Hallelujah. The culture of heaven is blessing everyone. If you were blessed, you are saying, Pastor, I was blessed. You want to give your offering. You want to give something. You want to connect. Go on right now. Go on right now. You can do it through super dance in the name of Jesus. Kisha Angel, I would love to see you tomorrow in the name of Jesus. Oh, my God. I would love to see each and every one tomorrow personally in the mighty name of Jesus. Confident, make sure you get a fruit tomorrow, a, a, a good and responsible fruit. Where is charity? Taz, God bless you. In the name of Mommy Vema, tomorrow I wish to see you also tomorrow, Mommy Vema. Hallelujah. We would good, good fruit. Mix the fruit. Somebody don't only bring banana. If your child get banana, get apple, get uh, uh, what, uh, 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 get any type of fruit. Just get the fruit. After the prayer, you mix it. Put it in you. To put it in you. It must work in the name of Jesus. Don't miss tomorrow's session for in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you for coming. God bless those that are connected with seed in the mighty name of Jesus. I keep on praying for you that God will keep on increasing and blessing you all family for in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Where is charity? Where is Kimbete? Where is Juan? I've not seen Kimbete. I've not seen Juan. Where is Juan? Oh my God. Where is Kimbete? Where is Juan? Where is charity? I think that they have all gone. God bless you, people of God. God bless you. Hallelujah. I, I am bringing a, a full salad. Wow, a full Oh, oh, mommy Vema is bringing a full salad. Mama, full salad, combination of everything. Our life must be sweet, whether the devil likes it or not, in the name of Jesus. Somebody, if your life has never had tests, tomorrow is an opportunity for you, for your life to have tests, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God bless you, Kimbete. Hallelujah. God bless you, Kisha Enje. Kimbete, it is well in the name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. I was looking for you, Kimbete. I cannot go without calling your name. You know you are the queen of Caribbean. God bless you. God bless you, family. Hallelujah. Good night or good afternoon, good evening, according to your timing. I love you all. Hallelujah. I pray that may the blessings of the Lord that make it rich and add no sorrow rest with you all. For in Jesus' name. Amen. Bye-bye, everyone. God bless you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Hallelujah. Good night, family. God bless you. See you tomorrow for in Jesus' mighty name. Queen of Caribbean, you are loving. Charity, get fruit tomorrow. Good, good fruit. Hallelujah. God bless you. Lilian, God bless you. Pastor Bazi, I am still with. Oh, my God, Sister Lilian, I am with you in the name of Jesus. I'm going to talk to you tomorrow, Lilian, in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless each and everyone. Bye-bye, family. Good night. I love you all. Sweet dreams. It's 7, oh, my God, in New York, York 7 p.m., it's already 8 p.m. Dubai time. It's already um, 3 a.m. Dubai time in the mighty name of... Taz, the pastor, wait. Taz want to tell us something. Hallelujah. Taz, do you want to give us announcement? I give you... God bless you. God bless you. 
Oh my God, Naomi River, God bless you. Naomi River, always there. God bless you, Naomi River. Hallelujah. God bless you, Naomi River. God bless you. God bless you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Taz, you want to say something before I drop the, the live stream? A father, God bless you. Father Samuel, God bless you. Some, oh my God, sometimes when I had fruit, hallelujah, I feel like God had given me, oh my God, straight in the name of Jesus. No issue. Tomorrow, tomorrow will be the final touch. Taz, tomorrow is the final touch. Hallelujah. God bless you. Bye-bye, family. See you tomorrow in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen.